What's up everybody, it's Coach Kev coming back to you guys again today with another reaction video. Today I'm going to react to my Team Miller 2020 girls going up against the Michigan Storm. I said I was going to start doing NBA reaction videos and that's going to be on the back burner as I still get a feel of what the NBA is doing and I just want to make sure I get it right. When I asked the question, should I stop doing these types of reaction videos, I got a lot of positive responses saying, no, I want, to, I want you to continue doing it. I don't want them to stop. I enjoy the backstory and I enjoy that you're emotionally connected because you actually coach these girls. I'm going to figure out some way to keep it in even when I start doing NBA reaction videos. If this is your first time here watching me do these reaction videos, I break it down into three parts. First, I give you a quick backstory about the game, then I react to the game, then I give you the lesson or lessons that I learned from coaching in the contest. Quick backstory about this game, it was at the Philly Face-Off Tournament in Philadelphia, the same place where I did the previous two reaction videos. If you haven't seen those videos, I'll put it in the cards up top. You can check that out after you finish watching this video. I don't really have much to say about this game other than it was the first game of the tournament. Anytime we had a first game, both teams would be kind of sluggish, trying to get used to each other. And it would be the game where you just have to figure out some way to win. At the end of the day, we're coming from New Jersey, they're coming from Michigan, and we wanted to represent Jersey. We always wanted to show that Jersey has some of the best basketball players out there. Shout out to my mom and my sister for getting me this hat too. So it's purpose driven. That's my YouTube channel name, Straight Fire. Before and after every game, we used to say this phrase, and it goes, play hard, play smart, play together. We're gonna say that phrase before I start this reaction video. Without further ado, let's get it. All hands in. What's the phrase on three? One, two, three. Play hard, play smart, play together. Team Miller, let's go, baby. Good pass, Kiana. Finish, Nina. Good job. Uh, good move. Come on. Ah, the shot. Ah, man. Knock it down. Nope. Good job. Come on, Em. Right up, right up, right up. Nicely done. She's not hooking. She's playing ball. Good job, Cynthia. Go strong. Good job. We'll stay with it. Ah, turnover. Get back, Em. Get back. Nice. Good hustle. Get that out of here. Good hustle. I want to show that once again. Emma just turned the ball over. Instead of putting her head down and feeling sad for herself, she sprinted back on defense, got the rejection. That's what our team was all about. Great job, Emma. Turn over, get back, look at that hustle. Look at her, look at her, look at her, look at her. Determined, good job, nice job. That's what wins games, baby. That's tough. Man, they're just getting layup after layup after layup. Good shot, Cam. Come on, Brent. basket. And one! Good, good, Cam. Downtown, three! Good, we're right in it, right in it. Pressure, pressure, we're up, we're up. 22, 22. Good, good, Maddie, middle. Good, good, kick, good. Good ball, pressure, Kiana. Good pressure, Emma. Five, five. Good pressure, five. Now you heard me screaming five. If the defender and the person dribbling the ball are closer than arm distance length, then the referee will start going like this, which is counting each second. One, two, three. If he goes to five, it's a turnover for the offensive team, and then the defensive team gets the ball. So I was screaming five second count to get the ball back. The other coach was mad too. Look at the other coach. He's pissed. Ooh, good drive. And one! Ooh, good hezzy. Get that out of here! Good job, Em. Good pass, man. From Jersey, East Coast, what we call this is they are styling on us. They are just getting layup after layup and doing whatever we want. We're just coming out sluggish. Like I said earlier, it's the first game of the tournament. It took us a while to get ramped up. Let's see if we can get ramped up in time to at least be able to pull out this victory or at least make it a close contest. Good pass, M. Come on, Brent, to the basket. Oh, can you believe Good reverse. Ooh. It's tough. Good hustle. And one, Kiana! 
And one! Let's go! Good. Okay. I kept this in for a reason. This is some of the best ball movement I've ever seen these girls do. The ball swings from side to side. Player movement, ball movement. If we have possessions like this every time down, we would not lose a game. I know that's not possible, but this type of possession I'm about to show you is what we strive for each and every time. Good, good. All right, Cam swings it. Good job, Brent. Basket, kicks it. Good, move, good. Oh, yes. Three, Emma. Let's go. Great offense. And then she comes down and hits a NBA three. All right. Yeah. Good move, Bryn. Ah, she missed it, stays with it. Extra possession. Good job, Bryn. Good job staying with it, Bryn. They gave us an extra possession. Great job. Good job, man. And one. And these girls can finish, man. Wow. Good job, Kennedy. To the basket. Let's go. We're here. We're up. Okay, we're up. What are we going to do now? We're not laying up. Let's go. Close game. Look at this. Look at this. Let's go. Let's go. 10, 10, 10. They don't get the ball over in 10 seconds from half court to the baseline. If they don't get the ball over half court in 10 seconds, it's a turnover. So that's a turnover all ball. 10 seconds violation. Let's go. All right, we're down by two points. Good job, Emma. Good steal. Tie game, 31-31, 31-31, we're up in it, we're up in it, 31-31, good pressure, good job, look at us again, look at us again, all right, let's save the possession, let's get a good possession, good job, Brent, that's tough, let's go, good, good look up, Em, foul, it's a foul, good, man, the other coach is mad, it's a tough drive, big three, That's tough. Good steal. Good. Hold it out. Hold it out. That's it. I think this is it. I think this is it. Yeah. Time is running out. Good. Yeah. Mm. We won. Yeah. That three that Keanu. So let me go back to that real quick. I just want to go back to the three pointer. You saw the possessions. Those were the game changers. Uh, us getting them the 10 second violation, making the tough layup hitting the three in the corner, those were the things that got us to pull out this victory. Because in close games, those are the little things that you need to do in order to get the win. I want to show you the three-pointer. I want to show you the people. Because this is what changed the game. The three-pointer by Kiana, bang! Big three, man, big, big three. And then you hold it out. And that's it, that's all they wrote. 39-35, close game, we started off a little sluggish, we picked it up towards the end, got into a tight back and forth contest, and we pulled out the victory. Once again, Team Miller with the victory, let's go, oh, yeah, yeah. What I learned from this game is that if you're always ready, you don't have to get ready. There was a lot of times when my girls would start off the game sluggish, and that was partly my fault as a basketball coach. I didn't have them ready from the beginning of the game. I had to do a better job of planning and preparing them so that they would hit the game running. They would take a while to get ready and get going on all cylinders, but once we started implementing that mindset, sky was the limit. In life, I know that you can't always be ready, but you gotta do your best to be prepared for every situation that comes your way. You don't wanna be the person that has the opportunity come to you and you're not ready for it. So do everything you can to be ready before you have to get ready. Shout out to my guy, Jay Black, who is a part of the battle rap culture. He has this phrase that goes a little something like this. Proper preparation prevents poor performance. If you prepare properly, then the chances of you performing poorly drastically decreases. If you got something out this video, subscribe to my channel. You can also like and comment. Do all those things that YouTube says we have to ask for in order for our channels to grow. Till next time, this is Coach Kev. Purpose driven on my hat. Team Miller across my chest. And I'm out. Peace.